Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Subnautica. Yee! I have my recipes pinned for the next thing I gotta do. I'm gonna make a little penguin today. Penguin? That's the word, right? Penguin, but not quite. I also wanna make a power cell recharger, but I just remembered I could as well make a moon pool eventually because that, if you put the vehicle in the moon pool, right, it recharges. I think it's time for a bioreactor is the word. But to have a bioreactor and to have stuff to put into it, like on a regular basis, I think I want like an outdoor grow bed first um, and then just grow whatever is a good power source for that in there. So I always have power for my base and I don't have an outdoor grow bed yet. So that's kind of like the next thing I really want. And the only base I haven't been to yet is the Omega base, right? So I'm thinking the outdoor grow bed must be there. But I also have been putting off looking into that mystery lady um, and her last signal so my plan for today got long intro make a penguin go to delta because there was a, a penguin hole there so i want to test it out see how that works then dive in the water close there to find our mystery lady and then possibly even in the same episode go to omega base how, how does that sound does that sound sound like a full long episode we might not get to all of those things but that, I think, is my next course of action. That's my plan. My itinerary from now on, I think. Unless I get distracted by a million things and we do something completely else. So let's see what happens. <laughs> so what is the deal with my inventory? Looks pretty good. I have a ton of water for some reason. I should bring a flare. Yes. I don't think I need one. But I have a million of them somewhere oh i have a third locker a million of them see one two three a million so i'll bring one of those in case i get cold i think it warms you up i think but i'm not sure so we have warmth we have also have a thermal blade wouldn't it be cool if the thermal blade keeps you warm just by bringing it out that would be so awesome but it's not that hot i guess I have a million things in my head that I want to do. I also really want to go back to Fai and explore that area better. But I think it's not the time yet for that. I think I want to go deeper now that our sea, sea truck has the depth upgrade. I think that would be a cool thing to do. Top it up. 102. Ah, oh, doesn't go past that. 72 water. Don't these give me water too? Yeah, five. So... There we go. That's pretty good. I think we're good then to go. Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. I want to bring the penguin. Jesus. Let's uh, let's get that in order, shall we? So we'll, we'll bring... I thought I had titanium in there. I had extra titanium somewhere. Where's the tit? Here. So two of those. The rubber thingy. And two silver. Rubber thingy. Silver. Silver. Let's make a wiring kit. And then we have a penguin. I think someone said I can just drag this. <gasps> That's brilliant. Come to me, my little penguin friend. Spy penglings. Scientists may have never discovered that penglings incubate their eggs in small cave burrows, often alongside thermal lily roots. Ah, so that's like your hint. Okay, that one's done. Oh, that's brilliant. Oh my god, I didn't know I could do that. Okay, copper and another tit. Um, that's gold. That's tit. That's nothing. Bullshit closet. Copper and another tit. I'm back. <laughs> you thought you were done, huh? So where do I make the remote? There. Okay, so I think we're good then. I can do this, go to Delta, do the spy penguin bit, and then we can dive in the water. And I'll, br I'll bring one food. I'm a little bit paranoid otherwise. Okay, let's save. Perfect. How are my batteries? Good, okay. 
Let's go on an adventure! Bye, base. See you later. I'm going to Delta. I'll be back late. Sorry, fish. I'll be back later tonight. Somewhere. Or tomorrow. <laughs> I wonder what I get. I thought I saw diamond. Um, when I tried to, like, peek through the hole. I also think I'm running out of lithium soon, so we should probably grab some more while I'm in this area. But first, Panklin hole. Because I don't know how how much stuff is in there, how much inventory space I need. I don't want to load up on lithium. And then, oh god, they're so scary. Evasive maneuvers! Oh, I saw something glowing there. It's all right there, though. What did I see? Oh, was it just this thing? Maybe it didn't load in yet. Oh god! Sorry! Didn't mean to disturb! I hope they leave my sea truck alone. I'll just park it, like, under here. Ouch. It's only at 60? I should repair it. Oh. <laughs> um... Repair, repair tool. Here you go, baby. I'll fix you up. I don't think they're close. There you go, baby. I'll see you later. I gotta go. Mama's gotta go explore. Okay. Um... Okay, gotta find penguin hole. What's this? Oh. Hmm, it's not here. Why? <laughs> that flower was like, need something. <laughs> it might be around here. I hope I hear it beeping. Yeah, this is it, I think. Does this all grow back? Or did I just not grab any of this before? I'm already grabbing so much. Okay. This is it. How are we gonna use these? Plop it down. So... How do I use it? Oh god. Oh god, what? It is diamond! Oh my god, that is so good! Holy shit, there's so much diamond in here! What? Eh, turn around. Inventory full. Oh yeah, I can only grab four things at a time, right? Go back to mom. Oh, look, there I am. That's so weird. Hi, Robin. <laughs> e to exit. Open storage. Thank you. Now go back. Stealth mode activated. Stealth mode? <laughs> the thing is so cute. It was diamonds. I thought that's what I saw. Oh my god, I got five diamonds in this cave. I think that's it though. I can't see anything else. That is so worth it. Oh my god, such easy diamonds. Okay. Exit. Thank you. I'll take that and pack it up. Okay. <laughs> awesome. That is so cool. Let's see that. So I don't accidentally turn it on. Okay, should I leave all of this or should I take all the gold and silver? That's no, all gold, isn't it? I'm I'm partly torn between either grabbing everything and then going back to my base and then go out and see follow the mystery lady, go into the deep. Yeah, I, I'm gonna do that. Because I, I have diamond on me now, and that was much more valuable than I thought 
was here. I didn't expect her to be diamond on an island. So let's just grab everything. Holy shit, dudes, four diamonds. Big news. <laughs> Amazing discovery. <laughs> that is a great place to find diamonds without having to go into the depths, you know? Okay, now I should be able to find my way back easily. I hope. God, this is really like a beginner's island compared to Fi. Fi, I felt like I was close to death so many times. But this is fine. Chucky, I'm back! Hi! Ooh, he's all the way out of the water. Uh, let's go back home. I think I have enough power to do all my traveling. And then I'll just bring the spare power cell that I made at some point. Where did I? I might have lost it. I... Oh, I'm so sorry. I might... <laughs> I might have lost it when I died a couple times. Unless I stuffed it in a locker somewhere with my flashlight and stuff. Hello everyone, I'm back. Oh yeah, wanna know something else? I threw these things out here, being like, yeah, whatever, I don't need it. And then I was reading comments and Welcome I just randomly realized that I made a bin. <laughs> I could have just thrown it in my bin. <laughs> Why didn't I do that? So my tit closet is full, right? Yeah. That one's full. This one's empty. Let's put the tit in here. Kind of want to put all the gold and copper together. Ah, it's too many. Okay. I'm not complaining. I think that's fine. Okay, there's my flashlight. Um, I'll probably just bring it back then. Nice. Perfect. Um, what else was I missing? There was something that I was like... Uh, one more. Thank you. Save that, because we put everything away. God, what was it? Something else that I was wondering about where it went. Oh, the power cell. Or maybe I had it and I just used it in the prawn suit. Oh, that might be it. That might be what I've done. Oh, it's two batteries. My precious batteries. I feel better having a spare power slot on me, you know? Just in case the sea truck loses power or something. Okay, so inventory empty. We got all the stuff we need on us. Now let's go do the other thing that we wanted to do and follow the last known position. Because now our little sea truck baby can go to 300 meters, so we should be able to easily explore wherever this is and then we have the rebreather so we can- oh I'm so sorry <laughs> so we can also go out and swim even deeper if we need to so we should be good I'll get some lithium later I still have some lithium I think oh it's so deep every now and then all these rocks here of course the... Oh, it is here, the purple. Do you think they'll attack the sea truck? I wonder if they can destroy the sea truck. That would suck. Oh, there's one. I think I... Oh, I see quartz. Okay. Let's just keep going. 
see. Lithium. This is not something I can know. Oh, I can't scan this though. Okay, no one around? Why does it sound like it's like coming straight for me? Ooh! Holy shit! There's a huge area here. What is it? Oh, something I already had. Great. Um, anything I can scan here? Get the map away. You're in the way. Oh, yep. Yeah. Sea truck aquarium module. You can put an aquarium behind your what? Oh, another disc. Someone said that the music is all copyrighted, so that's a shame for the um, for the jukebox. Okay, is that it? Fabricator module. Hmm. Fabricator on the go. I have so much oxygen. Where's my little truck? Where did I put park it? Oh, up there? Jeez. Get distracted so easily. Before you know it, you just lost your mom. In the mall. That was me as a kid, by the way. <laughs> I got lost all the fucking time. Oh, I see a lot of... A lot of tits here. No, not tits. A lot of lits. Tits and lits. I want to reinforce my base, so it's good to grab these now. Now that I'm in a little quiet area, you know? God, get him. Nice. That's a lot of lit. This shit is lit, man. I think that's about it for this direct. Oh god. I don't know if he saw me. Oh, hey. The welt team and two welt team and electrical. Control room rapid depressurization. We're getting closer. I know the control room will change the process of base building. It contains all the information you need in the singular place. Energy delegation for low sunlight areas. Build layout, structural information, we're leaps and bounds away from V1. Okay, control room, yeah. Which literally just rolled to the bottom of the ocean, even on flat ground. Rapid implosion is supposed to be painless. I hope that's true. Definitely a better way to go than the electrical fire in V7. Uh, V5.7. Poor way to go. Super unfortunate radio call to overhear. Jasmine was the la latest worker that volunteered to test the control room for hazard pay, of course. She was on the radio examining some information panels when she experienced rapid depressurization due to a hull breach. Apparently, the panels were welded poorly and blew a hole in the wall. So, no hazard pay for her, or anyone else for that matter. At least she didn't suffer. The next build should have the all the kinks ironed out. Hmm. Man. I guess even the development for that could go really wrong, huh? I can't completely fill up my inventory again on uh, lithium. <laughs> oh, people are saying those are friendlies, but I don't want them to eat my sea truck though. Can I swim with you, sir, ma'am? That is cool. <sighs> so cool. <laughs> okay, let's go into the green waters. Is there something in here? Can I fit? I'm not sure. I wanna know. I need to get that alien. Oh, there's nothing in here. There's just a rock there. Okay. Oh my god, it's coming right for me. They're so cool! Okay, let's see. Ah, here we are. 
This looks familiar. <laughs> this was so scary back then. A couple episodes ago. So I'm guessing we need to get to this point. So it's somewhere here, last known position. And then we should probably just go down as far as we can. So I've, I've swam around in here, right? That's where I got the gel sack and stuff. These look special, but I'm not sure. No, they're nothing. Let's take the sea truck down as far as we can. There must be some secret entrance somewhere, right? Ooh, gel sick. I have enough, though. At least now we can, like, swim through here. Completely chill. These look important. Let me just double check. Hive mind. Never alone and grow in massive clusters, physically connected by a root system. Signal activates uh, chemical signals in the presence of large predators. Smaller sea creatures confuse the change in color for sunlight and are drawn to it. Hmm. So it's just a plant. Cool plant. Cool story, bro. Those colors. Ooh. This is deeper. Ooh, ooh. We can't go deeper than this. Didn't I tell you to stay oh. away? From what? what? I don't even know who you are. Marguerite Maida is the name. <gasps> yes! My turf. Great. Marguerite! Can I come in and warm up? What part of go away do you not understand, Altera? Where is she, though? I'm not with Altera. So, I'm glad to see it confirmed, but unfortunately people spoiled it for me. Um, everyone kept like, no one outright said it outright, but everyone was like leaving like subtle hints. There's like one light there. Um, everyone was like kind of like dancing around it, but leaving hints to here and there. Hmm. Should I just go deeper? Oh, is this like a massive silver ore? Ooh. Oh yeah, there's another light there. Oh shit, there's a whole base! Wait, is she here? Is this her base? Holy shit, can I come in? I'm- oh, I feel like I'm not supposed to be here. Oh, this is her! Oops. Oh, I jumped so far out of the water. Uh, okay, I guess I'm out. <laughs> Customized prawn suit. Found it! Marguerite! Marguerite's so cool! So, for anyone who hasn't played the first game, Marguerite is the one, if I remember correctly, she was with, like, two others. They were on the island at first, and then they relocated to the Shroom Cave. And then Marguerite was the really tough one who was like, no, we gotta go deeper. Um... Ah, Jesus! Oh, God. That scared me. Oh, can I have your fur? <gasps> She's actually here. I told you to stay off my land. You're so cool. You framed that thing. Next time I'll let him tear you to ribbons, Altera. Oh my god, your room is so with cool. Altera. I'm Robin Ayu. I'm looking for information about my sister Sam. I think you might have crossed paths. Bull crap. I suggest you take the time you need to come to your senses and then get off my sea base. You're so cool. If you're not, Altera, why don't you disable that damn tracking satellite tower instead of barging into my sea base? Maybe once Altera's off my back, I'll remember something about your sister. Okay. There's some junk on that table that might help. I couldn't get it to work. Dude, that beastie is so cool. Can I, like, slice off a little bit of fur? 
Test override module. Oh, test override module. That's what we needed for that tower, yeah. To block communications, right? <gasps> Snow fox. That's two of three. That far out to sea, swimming back for land wasn't an option. I'd die from exhaustion long before I made it to shore. All I could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere. I felt a suction. And suddenly, there were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me. It had taken hours for the Reaper's corpse to float to the surface. Using the knife, I clambered up her flank and got a perch on top. I figured she'd float for a few days at least. Enough for me to catch my breath. But would she sink before or after I died of thirst? I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. At least I wasn't going to die of exhaustion. Now, those reapers, they're practically all muscle. But there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much. But I had that repair tool, so I had a spark. It took a week to light that first fire. And I know more about the burning properties of reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires. But as they burned, I could smoke meat that I carved out of the beast's rib cage. She lived in one of those? Is that what she's saying? She lived in a reaper? Yeah, because she... Okay, so she was the one, if I remember correctly, who was with the father and son. And then they went to the shroom cave. They set up a base there. And then when that all went south, she kind of, like, disappeared. And then they were left behind, I think... And they died in that shroom cave, I think, if I'm not mistaken. And I think she was hunting reapers, The bi if the reapers are the big ones. She was hunting them for their teeth, I think. I'm not sure, but she was like the danger, dangerous, oh, this is a big egg. Dangerous, adventurous type. Um, but yeah, unfortunately, some people were kind of like, Oh, she sounds a lot like M from technology Ooh. acquired. <gasps> sea drop defense, nice. Provides increased threat protection. Nice. <gasps> Snow stalker. Isn't that the fur I need? Very like evolutionary offshoot of the aquatic stalker. Thick hollow fur that secretes a thin layer of oil helps keep the snow stalker warm in the Arctic climate. Modified dorsal fin aid in aquatic hunting. Assessment avoid. If entering the snow stalker territory is necessary, sources of bright light and unpredictable noises have been shown to deter attacks. Oh, like um, flares. Oh, so remember that. Oh, I can make this. Nice. Remember that snow. Yeah, snow stalker fur. Um, so maybe we need to go back. Ooh. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> oh, he doesn't like me. Okay, sorry. Um, oh, I guess I gotta go. If only I could, like, take a bit of your fur. There's no fur laying around or something, right? Anything? No? Yeah, he doesn't like me. Okay. Well, I got what I needed, I guess. I guess I should go. Yeah. That's awesome, though. Um, let me look at her base from up above. So this is the room we came in. This is where we were. Nice. And then this room, we don't know. We don't know what she doing down there. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, what is that? Um, there was an oxygen plant I saw. Oh, I still have tons of oxygen. I can't scan this, but what is this? This looks important. Tree spire. This is not... Oh, I really thought this was something I could... What was a tree spire? Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay, nothing we can we can work with. Gotcha. Any other interesting plants I need to know of? Rubies? What's that? You're a knight! I really should take that. Huh. Oh, I should really take these. Oh, God. Um... I could go back to my sea truck. This thing is so big, but that makes me think that it's special. Ooh, what are you? Oh my god. Discus fish. Come here. Come here, friend. I just want to scan. Wow. What a beautiful one. Oh, is that a big eye up front? Colorful small fish. Laterally compressed body. Hmm. Nutritious prey. Okay, I shouldn't get too distracted. Keep an eye on my oxygen. Reaper's wine glass. Huh. Single single nucleus located in the rhizoid means that if the bulbous cap is removed or devoured, it will slowly grow a new cap. Oh. Penguin. Anything else? A still suit? What is that? Reclaim moisture from the body and provide clean drinkable water. What? Oh shit. That's a thing? So it continues that way. Man, she's set up at a perfect place. Damn. I'm jealous of her base. I'm legit jealous. This is such a good spot. What a cool place. Oh, gel sec. Oh, gold. Truck, I'm back. So we finally found her. Um, can we rename beacons? Um, where is she? This one. No, we can't. Let's turn it off for now. We can always turn it on back later. Back on later. When we need to find her. So cool! That was so cool! <laughs> Marguerite! That's so cool that they put her in the game. I wonder if she was many people's favorite in the PDA stories. Ooh, god. Oops, sorry. I came onto that much quicker than I thought. Hi, I'm here to take you home. Oh god. What was happening? What was that? Something tried to suck me in. The fuck was that? That little guy? What is that? Hmm. Oh, hi! Oh, should we maybe scan it? Let's go for it. Glow whale. There we go. Communal leviathans, approximately 30 meters long. Often found swimming in the open ocean and occasionally breaching the surface. Nice. They contain several types of bioluminescence. Glow horns as well. Wow. They emit a harmonious series of notes that resonate in their horns and release a series of chemicals that appear to create a joyful response in nearby whales. 
Passive harvests barnacles and algae. Huh. Cool. I, I can't really scan the scary ones though. Too scary. Okay, I have a full ass inventory. So let's head back again. And then I kind of want to work on my base a little bit. It has been 50 minutes already. God, time really flies. Look at these cool floating things. Oh. Okay, let's go back. Detecting stern of an astronautical Saltrans go vessel nearby. Vessel name, Mercury 2. Inoperative. Do you have a a beacon for that? I don't think so. A vessel nearby? Wait, is that it? <gasps> it's massive! Holy shit! Can we go in? Maybe? It looks like we might be able to go in there. Oh, there's definitely something to explore. Okay. Is there a danger nearby? No. Let's do this. Massive ship. Oh wait. <laughs> I gotta call it something else. Holy ship. <laughs> okay. We'll find that later. We have to- we have a full inventory. We need to go back first. Holy ship! That's a big ship. The M37. God damn. Well, I guess we're getting sidetracked. I really want to find that outdoor grow bed, grow bed, but... This ship is really, really cool. I don't see any lithium. That's good. Yeah, the lithium I wanted to get for um, increasing the hull strength of my base. But I think that... Oh. I was wondering what that was. I think that room that has the water filtration in it right now, I think I'll just get rid of that and then put either a big room there or maybe a moon pool and an extra room kind of want to look into a control room as well. Basically, the base is going to be big. Let's see. Welcome aboard, Captain. Where am I going to put all this stuff? Oh wait, I should put the lithium together, but I can't exchange it. Oh my god, everything is fucking full. What is that uranium for? There's gotta be something I need it for. An ion battery. I bet an ion battery needs like nuclear or something. Hmm. God, so many modules. I found so many parts, but not nothing's complete yet. I really want that docking module. Put my prawn suit on the back. Take it to Kappa Mine. Needs to be aligned, you know? At least a little bit. Just give me the illusion that it's aligned. That's fine by me. Okay. There. Space. Oh! That fucking huge egg. I don't know what it is, but... Oh yeah, and I could have put that away. Other than that, I think I'm good. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Okay. Nice. 
Oh, hey, babe. Hi. Hello, mister. You wanna come up? He usually doesn't like it when I play PC games, though, because my hands aren't, like, on my lap. Hey. Couple more days. This Friday, he's allowed to go outside. Not that I will leave, let him outside, but... Um, I'm gonna put, like, a little harness on him and then let him expl explore our backyard. So that should be super exciting. Yeah. Outdoors. And then next Friday, he's also going to get a worming treatment, just in case. He's got a flea treatment already. And then he's all up to speed. He likes it when I pet his back here, like a little, his butt. Hi. I gotta get back to gaming. Sit down. So, we dumped all of the shit. Now let's go explore that shit. Dumped the shit, now let's go to the ship. Holy ship. <laughs> yes, guys, I, I am a comedian. I know. Let's check out what this ship has to offer. Maybe it has a couple modules I can scan. That would be great. Oh my god, it's so big. Holy shit. Is it maybe... Is it maybe the Aurora that finally sunk? No. The PDA would have told it, said it was that then, right? God damn, so cool. Okay, I'm gonna go down here. Hey, Beacon, I'm back. Let's have a look. Oh, immediately something I can scan. Fishies? Spine fish. Ooh, he's see through. <laughs> he's missing a little tooth. <laughs> Small school mentality prey fish, closely related to hoop fish. Metal salvage! Oh my god, it is in the game. This is the first metal salvage I, I've seen. Right, all right, you can pick them up. Ooh, titanium ingots! Damn, we're starting off strong. Ooh, that copper. Oh. Thanks. Oh god, there's so much to it. I have to remember though. I don't have any. Back up oxygen on me, so I need to get out once it's halfway done. If I can get out quick. And find my way out. Oh. Okay, let me reset. Oh my god. It was right on top of me. And I had no idea. Back off, sir. Oh, can I laser this? Ah, oh, shit. I don't think I made a laser cutter yet. I think I can, though. I think I can make one. Ah, it's a two diamonds. Well, I have those now. Yeah, I should make one. They're good to have. Okay, so I went in there. I haven't gone up yet. Oh, another laser door. Is it? Is this blocked by glass? Oh. Oh, so is it just like a, a hint? They're being like, there's more here, just so you know. Okay, so maybe we can get upstairs? No, this is so confusing. More laser doors. Oh my god, there's a lot here. Oxygen plant. Metal 
salvage. Okay. Is this the way out? Let me go over. Maybe then uh, you don't attract the attention of the big boy. Okay, we need a laser cutter. So, let's go make one. It's a laser cutter! Wow! It's amazing! Um, there. Oh, and I still forgot to put the new thing in. There you go. Defense upgrade. For you. I don't know how to use it, but... Do I press 1? Okay, now it's on. Oh. Oh. I've never used that before. Okay, let's cut away. Here we go. Maybe I should have brought a spare battery. I don't know how quickly this thing drains. Ah, it should be fine. I think I might have picked up a battery too. Yeah, I do. Okay. Hey, that's nice to see. Okay. I shall remember that plant. Hello, friends! What's up? Ooh, power cell. Nice. Copper. Also nice. Is that another power cell? Parallel processing unit. The steel suit, right? The water suit? Aquarium model, fabricator model. Hmm, so it's just a model that has a fabricator on it. Hmm. It's not too bad. If I had that, I wouldn't have had to swim all the way back to my base, you know? To make the laser cutter. Well, I had to because my diamonds would have been at the base. So maybe it's actually not that useful. Never mind. There's so many places I can explore. Sealed door. Let's see what's inside. Maybe another fragment of skin? This seems like a battery thing. I don't know what these are, but I'll find out. Let me scan or open up. Oh. Wait, am I in a different place? Oh shit, I'm starting to get. I'm starting to lose my way. Oh. Okay, maybe I should. Maybe I should reset. Okay, so there's another entrance there. Oh, I'm right here! Okay. Catch my breath. And... here we go. Okay, let's go the same way. So we'll go here. And then I saw a door. Oh, there's also up here. Oh my god. Uh, okay, let's go through this one first. There's so much. Oh, I can't cut this one? Hmm. Um, that actually might make things easier. I might not be able to go everywhere. This is the door I saw. This one can open. music 
I feel like I'm like doing Mission Impossible, breaking into a vault. <laughs> I'm a hacker. Dun, 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 dun. Show me the treasure. What is it? Another laser cutter. Oh, not very useful for me. Okay, I think this is a door I went by earlier. Can't cut this one, but I have been there because that's open. Okay, let's go up further. So, this room. Yeah, I haven't been there yet. Oh, there's a vent up there. Okay, so that means we have to get two floors up. So, one floor. Two floors. And then somewhere here, we have to find a vent that we can go through, right? In most cases. Hmm. Oh, PDA. Mercury uh. 2. I can only do repairs in spurts. That's so inefficient. The larger tools seem to set off seismic activity nearby. A crew came back telling stories of gigantic worms burrowing in the ice. I don't know what they're all going on about. They were hypothermic and frostbitten because they walked back to avoid angering them. The ice shelf is probably a bit unstable and they got disoriented or something. To borrow from Diana. Orion's belt. Thermocouplings are not meant to be worked on in 20 minute spurts. If we break the process, we'll break the ship. <sighs> but it's nice to hang out with Yasmin while we wait for the rumbles to stop. I hope she doesn't mind all my questions. I love hearing her voice. Her face lights up, and she's got the most expressive eyebrows. Mm. They're practically acrobats. <laughs> The way she looks when talking about nuclear engineering is the same way I look at my grandmother's domades. The domades? Woman never sits What's down. that? She told me that she used to do decathlon in college, and I can believe it. She's like a bouncy ball, just mm. all over the place. Lots of energy. She makes rounds on the ship every day to see if people need help. Hmm. I should do something nice for her. She's always helping everyone else. I wish I had a fraction of her energy. <laughs> no, what a nice file. Oh yeah, those cells. What is that? Hmm. There's got to be a way we can find that third fragment, right? <gasps> Ooh, maybe this. Oh, I might need to make um. I need to make that propulsion cannon. So I can move that stuff out of the way, I think. That might be it. That's definitely one area I haven't been yet. And the rest, I don't think I can find much. Ooh, nice. Advanced wiring kit. Okay, that one room is the only one I can think of. If I move the stuff out of the way, I might unlock a new section that I haven't been to yet. Other than that, I can't really find much. Okay. Unless we find another entrance. Like up top here somewhere. Don't want to get anyone's attention, though. Any of the big guys. Ooh. Maybe I can go there? Let's see.
could swim down here, but I don't see anything. No hole along the edge or something. Don't think that's anything we can go into. Oh, there's some stuff there. Hmm, nothing on the ceiling though. Yeah, nothing here. Nope. Okay, it's probably that one door that leads to a bunch of other stuff. So we'll just leave that beacon there and go back to the base and make a cannon. Warp gravity to pull and push objects. Wiring kit and titanium. Not too hard to make. Here I go again on my own. I'm going to the only ship I know. Now, let's see if this is worth it. Well, it's worth it just for the exploring alone. Just the fact that we can go in, see all there is to see, and then be comfortable knowing that we got all the things that we wanted to get, you know? That alone is already worth it, even if the items we get are shit. Okay, now let's see if this even works. How is this working in? Grab item. Does work. Here we go. Uh, put this away. Sealed. Oh. I've never had sealed containers before. Ooh, what the fuck was that? Reactor rod. Power nuclear reactors. What? 100%. Um, do we get anything else in this room? That is the question. No, it's nothing! So this isn't it. Well, it's worth it because I got some kind of reactor thing, but... Hmm. There must be more. Where is it again? Here. It must be that opening. How do I get there? Okay, so... Oh, can I maybe... I don't know if I can break these. No, probably not, right? No, I can't break and op break open those. Oh yeah, doesn't it turn when it sees something? Oh, that's a fish. Ooh, I'm sorry. Yeah, it turns when it sees something it can interact with. Okay, with the help of Sean, I found it. <laughs> It took me a while. It's like right by the oxygen plant. Uh, I don't know if you guys recognize this. That's where I found that other cell or fragment cell thing. And then it's right here. Okay, so let's have a look. And I think that's the last thing I can get in this ship. Found it! Ah yes, a PDA! Nice! I finished the reactor checks. We dumped a ton of runoff and we don't need the rods melting down. Then I helped with the scavenging, chopped some veggies with the cooks and tried to help Diana, but she sent me down to engineering with Stephanos. I've been working with him the last few days. Stephanos... How to describe Stephanos? He's by far the most thorough engineer I've worked with, and no ego. He never leaves a job undone, no matter how late it is. And he likes I've my never eyebrows seen him awake for some before reason. 11, and he always greets me by saying, Kalimera, Yasmin, 
in the sleepiest drawl. Not a morning person, that one. <laughs> he listens with the slightest smile on his face and twirls this stray curl by his ear. He asks a billion questions, but I don't Cute. mind. He surprised me today. There's an empty room on the bridge, just a spot of negative space in the ship. He set a picnic there and said, I need to relax. He even called me a busybody. There were these crazy glowing fungus things he found to set the ambiance. The most exciting part though, drum roll, he can jailbreak fabricators. Ooh. He made a small batch of traditional Grecian dishes, but the craziest part? He managed to make a suitable falafel for me. Oh, falafel's amazing. I never thought I'd see a good falafel in deep space. Alhamdulillah. A quiet genius, that one. This planet may be a cold mistress, but maybe it isn't oh, so bad. I love falafel. So good. With, the, with like a nice little sauce on the side. Ooh, so good. Ooh, titanium ingot. Yes. Okay. Um, that it? I was hoping to get like that third fragment, but I guess not. I guess that's it. Should go back quick for oxygen. I um, should be fine, but I think we got it now. Um, should I go out here? Should go back this? No, not this way. Oh god, I'm lost, aren't I? No, no, no. Here, here. This is how I go back. Well, I think that's all I could find in here, so... Should probably head back. I don't have... So what have I been scanning? I should have two out of... Oh, here! Parallel processing unit. Ingredients unknown. Hmm. Well, it's probably important. Uh, okay. Let's go back. Back to base. I wanted to work on my base today, but I... Like I said, I will I get, got distracted by something, so... But this ship was really cool, though. I'm glad I found it. Is that a piece? What is that? Oh, it's just a plant. Okay. Yeah, I'm glad I found that. That was cool. We found uh, Marguerite's awesome base. And we found this awesome sh shipwreck. With some cool PDAs inside. I like it. And I found my first um, green rock. The nuclear kind of rock. That's awesome. I think that's going to be useful for something. I don't know what yet. But I remember using it for crafting. I think it's that ionic battery. Maybe? No. Maybe. I don't know. I don't really remember. But I think for now... Next, I think next episode I should start with base building. Maybe go to Omega Base first, because I really think the outdoor grow beds are there and I really want them. And then maybe expand my base, put in a uh, bioreactor, and then grow whatever I need in the outdoor grow beds. Some gel sacks, some... I'm guessing those ribbon plants that we use for batteries, they might be helpful for the bioreactor. Because it's basically a, a battery ingredient anyway. So I'm guessing that might be good energy. If you have advice on what is good energy, let me know. But yeah, I also really want a moon pool so I can charge these babies. I could look into... Maybe quickly making... Oh god, this game's addicting. Um, what do I need for a cell charger? Yeah, I can easily make that. Advanced wiring kit. What was that again? Computer chip with a wiring kit. Okay. Let's quickly just make that, shall we? Okay, so we put all the gold... Somewhere. Okay, we need two lithium. Uh, 
wiring kit. It's too silver. This one. Then this one. Look how smooth. I think I need to make it into Habitat Builder. Um. Um, I wanted to put it there, but actually, since I want to replace that room anyway, I'll put it here. This might cripple the power supply of my base. I'm well aware, but I'm close to the point where I'm going to upgrade to a bioreactor, so... Um, it shouldn't really matter for now, I think. Nice. That makes me feel better, that I have that set up now. Um, let's have a little drinky. Perfect. Put the food away. Oh, there's another power cell in there. God, I have so many of these. <laughs> I never eat them. Yeah, I'll put these with the rest. So I don't have to look around for them. There. Nice. Perfect. Looks like so far power is fine. During the day at least. I know it'll drain during the night, but I can just go to bed and then it's morning again, so. Nice. Save that. Okay. Whoa, so much happened today. Ha! Huh. So fun. Okay. We found Margaret's base. We found out that she's Margaret, officially. I had my suspicions because of spoilers. Um, then we also found our little block of whatever it is, uraninite. I have used that for something. Radioactive material, but I'll find out later what it's for. What else happened? We found the mercury wreckage and we explored that as much as we could. Made a propulsion cannon, laser cutter. We used our penguins successfully, got four, five diamonds out of that. So much happened today. All good, good stuff. Next episode, I'm going to start off by expanding my base. Um, set up that bioreactor, I think. Or, or go to the the Omega base. I want to have maybe have a peek over there, see what that's like, and find those outdoor grow beds, you know? It's the only base I haven't been to yet. Um, I also want to get the cold suit, but I think I need to look around where we were attacked by that creature on around the Phi base. There's still a ton we can do and explore. There's also a new place that Alan wants us to check out, so that's also still there. There's so much we can do. But I think next up we're going to start off with Omega base and expanding our own base. I think that's a good plan. Anyway, we'll see if that happens. Maybe we'll get distracted again. Who knows? Every Anything can happen in this game. I'm just enjoying the heck out of it. So I hope you guys are too. Leave a like if you did. And I'll see you guys soon with more. Mm -hmm.